Any footage used in this video is not my footage, so credit for the footage goes to whoever I happen to uh, get the footage from. Thanks. Hey there guys, what's going on? It's me, KGO, Kenny, whatever you prefer to call me. Um, I've uh, decided to do a review, I guess, of uh, The Walking Dead Season 2, Episode 1. Um, I think the episode's called All That Remains or something like that. Um, I didn't, I mean, I think it came out like back in December, I think. Yeah, uh, North America, December 17th, 2013. So why the fuck am I doing doing this now, almost a month late? Well, I got um, $40. Um, it was a Christmas gift from one of my cousins uh, for the PlayStation Network. And I decided to buy the season pass for Walking Dead Season 2 game because uh, Season 1 was awesome. So I figured, you know, um, you know, it, this would be cool too. So I g got around to actually find, finally getting it, settling down, playing it. Uh, I, I don't even remember when. Like, I think like January 8th or 9th or something like that. Um, so anyway, uh, so yeah, um... If you haven't played the the, uh, the game yet, then there will be spoilers in this video. So I'm going to discuss my choices, you know, why I made them, you know, uh, what I think it would lead to, what I think the future holds for this episode. So this video might be a little long. So just you know, just a, just a heads up if you don't want to watch like a like a 15-20 minute video. But I I do plan on kind of like a like a thoroughly discussing it. So. Anyway, so season two, uh, you're playing as Clementine now. Clementine is an innocent little girl that you found as Lee back in um, uh, season one of the of the Walking Dead video game, the good game by Telltale Games. Uh, I got the Wikipedia page open right now just so I can have a, a bit of a refresher of how the plot goes and everything. So uh, the beginning of the game, um, uh, the first thing starts, uh, you're with Omid and Krista. Krista is really late in her pregnancy. Um, and uh, you're going to a gas station to, like, you know, freshen up and shit. But then, uh, like, some psychotic bitch comes in with the, you know, steals Clementine's gun. Is like, oh, no, you're in there. Come out and everything. And uh, I was uh, I was pretty apprehensive, you know what I mean? I was, you know, I was like, l legit kind of, uh, you know, kind of fr freaking out a bit. Um, I didn't know, you know, what was going to happen, what she was going to do. At first, I thought I recognized her, but then I was like, nah, I don't recognize her at all. I see you. Um, and then, Omid coming into to, to the gas station, I was like, yo, Omid, Omid, save me, man, save me, man. And, um, and then, uh, and then, uh, the, the door happens to close, which is like, it, that took a, that door took a long time to close. And then she shot him. Um, and then, uh. I was like, yo, like, I thought he was shot in, like, the ribs or something, but then it turns out that he was, like, pretty much shot in the freaking heart, and I was like, damn. Then Krista comes in, kills her, and then, uh, the story fast forwards, like, a year and a half, like, 16 months or something like that, and, uh, it looks like Krista lost her baby, um, and, uh, you know, she's, like, she's, 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 she's pretty much like me right now, you know what I mean? She's, she's, she's withdrawn, she doesn't care about anything. And, obviously, the relationship between Krista and, um, Clementine has become strained. You know, she's, she's not, like, sugarcoating anything anymore. You know, you gotta learn how to do this, you gotta learn how to do that, you know, stuff like that. Then, um, she goes off to find something, I don't remember what. And then, um... And then uh, Clementine hears her uh, being confronted by these other survivors, other people, and then uh, you run away from them. It's so it was, it was pretty cool. Uh, then you um, then you pass out in water and you wake up uh, on, on, on the shore. You find a dog, which was pretty cool. I think his name was Sam or something. Uh, and I, I love dogs, you know what I mean? I'm, 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 a, I'm, I'm a dog guy, I'm a big dog guy. I, I had a dog myself until I had to, to uh, put it down a few, few years ago. Worst day of my life, 1-800 bar none. Anyway, um, I think I'm talking too fast, so let me slow down a bit. <laughs> um, so, you, so, you bef so you befriend uh, the dog, Sam, and uh, you find this, uh, these tents and this like camp area that's been abandoned and shit. And then uh, you, you you find a can of food in the garbage, and then uh, you you go to eat it, and Sam's like sitting down, you know, in front of you, 
with you know with the classic dog eyes you know what i mean trying to you know tr trying to make you feel bad for it into you know feeding it and shit and then uh, i'm a dog eye you know what i mean so like when it when it gave me the option to, to feed it i'm like fuck yeah dude i you know I, I gotta feed this dog man it's you know you know the dog is more important than me and then when it um and then we took took the whole can and Clementine's like, whoa, don't eat all of it. And then it freaking snapped onto her arm and like was like biting away like a shark, like freaking just biting into a a human leg. I was freaking out, yo. I was freaking out. And then um and then and then like I and then it gave me the option to punch it. And I'm like, oh god, I just ugh, I don't I don't want to do that. You know, I just I did not want to do that. But since the game gave me no choice, I punched the dog and uh, I hit it with the bricks or whatever the hell it, it gave me the option to do. And then, uh, and then um, when it got off you, and then uh, when it was about to pounce on you, I was like, damn it, I really have to do this, don't I? So then I was like, yeah, okay, fine. So I kicked the dog, and then it and then it went off screen. Um, sorry, I'm, I'm I'm about to get like really choked up, like for, you know, like, like for real. I mean, I mean, you can't see me, so that's good because I'm I'm about to like tear up. <laughs> oh god, damn! I I don't want to talk about this part, but um. So then you hear, this, so then you you hear the dog kind of going ape shit, and then Clementine gets up and she walks over and I thought that the dog was you know like a was like eating the shit out of the food because and then the harsh truth of it um oh Jesus uh she uh she she she, she kicked him and then he landed in like these like spikes or something and just seeing that dog in so much pain like no shit, it's fake, you know what I mean? It's a video game, it's not a real dog, it's not actually happening. But just the visual of seeing that, sorry, yeah. Sam. It's it was just it was like really difficult for me to see. And then um it gave me the option to either kill the dog or leave it. <coughs> and um honestly, I did this part twice. I did it twice because I at first I killed the dog because I because I I wanted to put it out of its misery. And then, like, I, I, like, I couldn't look. You know what I mean? I couldn't watch the screen. You know, because she took out the knife. And then I'm like, oh fuck, I, I can't watch this. Like, because I assumed it was gonna show it. And, um, and then, like, and, 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 like, I, I opened my eyes at just the right time to see her stab it. I'm like, fuck. And then, like, 20 seconds afterwards, I was like, you know what? No, no, I, I can't do that. I can't live with myself. I couldn't do it. So I, um, reset the game. I reset the game, and I, uh. I just like I just walked away. Um, so then what happens? Oh yeah, that's right. So 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 then you got that nasty dog bite, and then um, uh, she's passing out, and she's rescued by two members of the local survival group. Then when they see the dog bite, they go ape shit. Um, that was pretty freaking crazy. You know what I mean? Like how convenient to be to be bit by a dog, and then like and, and, then, and, and then like minutes later be uh, be rescued by by two guys, and, and then you get a bite on your arm. Like oh my god! Like what the hell were their names? Um, I think the one, one guy's name was Luke. I think he kind of reminded me of, of Brandon Fraser. I don't know if you guys see it, but the other guy was I think Pete and. Luke, like, he was carrying you, and then you see the bite, and he drops you. Like, <laughs> I find that kind of funny. And then how you pass out after trying to convince him into dog bite. You wake up uh, amidst uh, lots of arguing, and, uh, the, you know, everybody's like, you know, everybody's like, you know, they, they, they see the bite, and they go, what the hell is she's been bitten? And then, like, Pete's like, no, it was a dog bite. She said it was a dog bite. And, I, and, I, and, I'm, and I'm just thinking, what do I gotta do to convince these people to believe me? You know what I mean? Because it's a dog bite. It's a dog bite. Not a, not, not a walker bite. It's a dog bite. Um, and, then, and then just the whole arguing back and forth. And then the doctor saying, you know, I'll treat you in the morning um, if you haven't turned yet. And then they lock you in the shed. Like, I was like, what the fuck you doing, man? Like, I... Yeah, okay, fine. I can see the argument, you know what I mean? I can see the argument. You know, okay, she might turn, so, you know, why waste my supplies on a person that's going to turn into a zombie? You know what I mean? So, you know, that makes sense. But at the same time, like, I might not have till morning. You know what I mean? Like, look at this fucking bite. Look at it. it, 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 it this shit can get affected. And who knows if that dog had rabies? You know what I mean? And then, you know, 
that you know that requires like really prompt and fast treatment you know what i mean so um so then like i escaped from the shed and then i like i i got into the house and like oh man yo that was sneaky shit right there that was awesome i really enjoyed that um and uh going into the house and like uh like uh, eavesdropping in on their conversation, I almost got caught like four times because because I was waiting for for, for the screen to get like really red on the edges, and like I, I I'm surprised I I didn't get caught. I I really am. Um, <coughs> so um, so then I, I I I went up the stairs because there was nothing else to do to do down the stairs. I was like, should I go upstairs? Like I don't know if like somebody's gonna be up there like waiting for me or whatever. And then I open and I open the bedroom door and I see Sarah, uh, that doctor's daughter, I think. And um, shit, yo, I saw her face and I'm like, oh fuck. And then like, and then you know, I think something's up with her. You know what I mean? Because like, she's just like, I mean, people. I mean, I, I was talking to a friend about this and he said, you know, that I don't think there's really anything wrong with her. She's just like, you know, she's like really sheltered. You know what I mean? Like her father. Uh, doesn't want her to see how bad the world is now, and therefore she has no clue what the world is like because she's she's ridiculously sheltered. And I just, I mean, yeah, I can see that argument. You know, I really, really can. But at the same time, it's like, no, you know, no. I I honestly think that there's something else going on. You know, there's definitely. A, I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. But there is something going on. And I think we will find out about it um, soon enough. Maybe not the next episode, but maybe episode three or something like that. But you know, you know, with the way she was like, "Well, I can't help you if you're not my friend." You know, like you gotta be, be my friend, or else you know, or else you know, fuck off, and I'll, and I'll tell my dad. And then because I'm like, dude, this this girl is not gonna get, is not gonna help me out unless I piggy promise her and tell her I'm her friend and all that. Like I was thinking rationally, you know what I mean? Like when I play, when I play the. When I played the season one, uh, I made all my choices based on the choices I would actually make. You know what I mean? Like I wasn't this, I, like I really w w wasn't thinking about like how the characters would react or anything like that. Like I'm putting myself in Lee's shoes, and I'm putting myself in Clementine's shoes. You know? So like I was acting like okay, if I was in this situation, w w what would I say to her? You know? And, th and then uh, and then uh, when Sarah was like, you know, are we friends? I said eventually. You know what I mean? Be be because because like obviously I'm, I gotta try to convince her that I'm her friend, but at the same time, like I don't even know you. So like why the hell would I be your friend? You know? Like there, there definitely is. So then I picky promised her, and she gave me the shit. I found the needle. I found the stitches and everything like that. And then I and like and like I was so worried that that that, that, that I was gonna get caught that I just raced. I don't I, I I didn't even give a crap at that point. You know what I mean? I just raced down the stairs. I raced into the exit, and then I got got back in the shed. And then uh, some people I know were having trouble playing the part where you actually stitch yourself because it's like oh, really gory or or like gruesome or shit. I mean, I, I I really don't see that, you know. And like, I'm I'm not a macho guy, you know what I mean? Like, I'm probably the antithesis of that. I'm like the opposite of that, you know. Like, I don't I don't care about being like, you know, uh, macho or you know, brave or anything like that. Like, I'm not that, you know. But at the same time, I just I just couldn't see that, you know. I just I don't know. I mean, but the the, the acting the the acting was pretty good. But like, I don't know. I I didn't have a, I didn't have a hard time getting through through that at all. Um. So then, like, in the midst of the stitching, uh, which took a long damn time, like, Jesus, um, then the walker attacks you, and then she, uh, she kills, she kills the walker, the people go, anything, go, in, go, go into, to, to the shed, and then she's like, see, I haven't turned yet, so let me the fuck in, you pieces of shit, and then they're like, fine, come in, so then, um, so then some of the guys befriend Clementine, you know, they're, they're, they're cool with her, uh, the, the, that, that one bitch, uh, the pregnant lady, I think, I think, what was her name? Uh, I think her name was Rebecca? I think her name was R Rebecca. She is a real bitch. Like, oh my god. Oh my god. I, I just didn't lie. Yo, seriously. When you're, when you're eating soup and you're like, she, you're like, you're the only one in the room with her. And then like, she, she, she was like, raising the dishes or whatever. And then she's like, you better not make yourself too comfortable. And then, um, like, out of the choices that were there... Like, I kind of wanted to taunt her a bit, you know what I mean? So, like, I asked her, 
who's you know who uh, who who's the father you know like uh, who's whose baby is that and she's like excuse me and then she walked over to you and then uh and then when you're when you're able to uh say something to her and that camera angle yo like you can't see you, you like you, you couldn't see clem's eyes you know what i mean like all you could see was was like the the, the brim of her hat that looked so sinister yo that looked so cool i really i really like that camera angle and then I, I said, you should be nicer to me. And, uh, yo, like, I was creeped out by, by Clementine, man. Cre creeped out. Um, so, anyway, the next morning, you you, 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 uh, you go with How Pete and Nick to look for food. You come across bodies of, of, uh, of numerous Jack dead people rest. killed by human hands. Oh, it, it was killed by human hands? Oh, that's right. That's right. Yeah, that that's why they're making such a big deal out of it. I'm, I'm, I'm bugging. I'm bugging. Uh... Yeah, I mean, when you investigate the bodies, um, I noticed Can that I yeah, w w one of the guys was one of the people who attacked Krista, and um, and uh, I was asking him about K K Krista, and he's like, "Please water." I'm like, "Fuck you, bitch! You get water when when you tell me where, where my companion is." You know what I mean? So like, I refused the water. I I, I wish I could have just like took a big sip of water while looking into his eyes and go, "Ah, that was really good water." I wish I could have done that. I so would have done that, because that guy was a dick. Um, so then, um, so then, uh, um, oh really? For real? I'm reading the Wikipedia page right now because I'm like refreshing myself, like I said earlier. And uh, you're forced to help one of the two while the others lost in the attack. I helped out Pete. I helped out Pete. I, Nick didn't look like he died. Huh? Okay, that's that's kind of that's kind of weird. Oh yeah, and then the. The coming attractions of um, episode two. Um, the thing that intrigued me the most is probably obvious. Clementine saying, "I thought you were dead." So obviously, that's referring to somebody from the first season. Now, there's lots of speculation going on as to who that could be. You know what I mean? Um, the the two uh, the two uh, most popular theories I've heard is that it's either uh, Krista or Kenny and Krista I mean I really don't have any reason to think that Krista would be dead I think she's still alive you know she's still alive I just don't know where she is you know what I mean you, you, you know you got separated you know that's that's not really a reason to you know to, to think that she's dead you know I just I, I don't I don't think I don't think it's um I don't think it's uh it's Krista uh, Kenny? Um, no, this is, I I don't think it's Kenny. Cause you remember an episode. I mean, I I mean I don't really r remember a hell of a lot about what happened. But I remember back in season one when uh, when Kenny locked me in the gate. Um, I think I trampled on by those walkers. There's legit no way he could be alive. There's no way. There's no way. Um, so I don't think it's Kenny. Who do I think it is then? Um. Some people were saying it's Omid, and no, this is not Omid. He was shot in the fucking heart. You know what I mean? And the fact that, like, they didn't take him, like, anywhere right away, like, no. There's no way. If he, he was shot in the heart, so if you're shot in the heart, either you're dead or you're gonna be dead in, like, two minutes. And it was obviously way over two minutes, so, like, they, they couldn't have, so, like, he couldn't have gotten help or anything, you know? So, who do I think it is? I'm trying to remember the characters from season one. Um, let me look at the Wikipedia page for season one real quick. Maybe there's like a listing of characters. Um, here we go. Setting, setting, and whoops! I what the fuck. Sorry, I, 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 I just bugged. Um, okay, setting and characters. Uh, oh, there's there's no easy list list. Okay, obviously, it's, obviously it's not Lee since he's always you know since he died as a walker now. Clementine. Let's see. Uh, it's Kenny? No, I don't think it's Kenny. Katja? No, she killed herself. Duck? No, he's he no he's eaten. He's dead. Lily? Lily? What happened to Lily? I for I for. Oh, was Lily the was Lily the one you? I think yeah, Lily was the one that you left on the side of the road, right? Either that or she took the RV. I think I left her on the side of the road, but people have said that uh, that if you sided with her or something, that she took the RV and like drove away or something. Um, so it could be Lily. I doubt it, though. Larry? No, he's dead. 
Uh, Carly. Uh, no, she's dead. Uh, Douglas. No, he's dead. I pretty sure. Well, he was killed in mine, so. I know who Glenn? No, I, no, I have no reason to believe it would be Glenn. Mark? Who, who, who was Mark? Not how Mark. the world works now. Oh, that's right. That was that... Yeah, that was... Yeah, I'm... I, yeah, no, that's no, it's not Mark. Ben... Benjamin? No, it's, no, it's, no, it's not Benjamin. Uh, Chuck? Who the fuck was Chuck? The hobo! Chuck. No, it's not Chuck. He's dead. Um... Oh, uh, who could it be then? Oh, me and Krista. No, I no, it is neither one of them. <coughs> Molly. Who was Molly? Clementine? Molly was the. Mo oh, Mo oh, Molly. Okay, the female version of Daryl. Um, no, no, that's no, not Molly. Vernon. No. Um, the stranger. Who is this? Anthony and Roger. Who the hell is? Oh no no no! Never mind. That was the voice actor. I'm bugging. Um, I don't know. I have no idea who it could be. No clue whatsoever. Um, do you guys have theories? I don't know. Um, so yeah, that was what I. Th uh, overall, I didn't even say what I thought. Overall, I thought it was awesome. I thought it was really great. I I, I thoroughly enjoyed it. Um, it took me about uh, like an hour and ten minutes to to beat it. So. You know, it was a bit on the short side, you know what I mean? But, uh, you know, that's, that's, uh, you know, that's, that's whatever. It, you know, it was, you know, it was setting it up, you know what I mean? I mean, I, I, quality over quantity, you know what I mean? Like, I would rather play a game that lasted half an hour, but was amazing, than play a mediocre game that was like, that was like six hours long, you know? But overall, I thought it was great. I, I, th I, I, I was very entertained. It, it, we were introduced to... <laughs> A bunch of characters. Um, right now, it seems like Luke and Pete are the only ones that are really important at the moment. Maybe the Doctor and possibly Sarah. But um, the Doctor, I don't like. You know, he 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 seems he seems very untrustworthy. He he seems very I mean, suspicious of you. Serious. But uh, I, uh, I think I like Luke we are not the, the most. You know, he seems to be the most rational one because. of the group. Of course, after the. You know the whole bite situation was solved, but I I thoroughly enjoyed it. You know, and I'm very much looking forward to uh, the future of what this game holds. Um, I don't know when episode two is going to be released. My guess is probably mid February, which is a long freaking time to wait. But you know, I'd rather wait for a quality product than have a product that shed out too uh, quickly and like ends up being bad so uh, that was uh, th that was my uh, that was what I did in episode one um, this video went on a lot longer than I thought it would so I apologize in advance guys if this video was too long for you which one did you, did you guys make uh, who do you think is the person that uh, is introduced in episode two and Clementine thought they were dead um, share your thoughts below I'd love to hear them and um, until next time guys Peace.